Technology at UNH is uh, really an ever-expanding role for us. Anybody in our environment can consume any of our services, and our population ranges anywhere from the 15,000 undergrads with the 5,000 plus faculty to the many thousands of alumni. The software-defined data center for us was the best logical step and the most cost-effective step. We do more with what we have, and that's something where VMware definitely comes in for us. Network virtualization reduces our operating cost. With NSX today, I can provision a workload faster than I could before within a couple hours. The key benefits for NSX right out of the gate was micro-segmentation. We have the alphabet soup uh, for compliance, everything from FERPA to HIPAA to CGIS to PCI. When it comes to requirements, security is a pretty huge piece for us. We knew virtual networking was the wave of the future. With NSX, we saw that it was the solution to our problems. We've been deployed with NSX for about 18 months now. NSX allows us to better manage our environment and stay ahead of any threats. It allows us to stand up virtual workloads really quickly now. We can now co-locate faculty student machines in the same environment or same hardware stack and provide much greater security and visibility into that. With Horizon View and NSX, we're able to secure individual workstations in terms of the security related incidents. Log Insights allows us to report and search on those. It compartmentalizes each VM as much as possible. We're currently using VRealize operations with NSX integrated. We're able to see any number of performance issues, any issues that might crop up on the virtual network. From a DR perspective, we're looking to do the layer two stretch to our secondary data center, or we're looking to transition to an active-active setup with NSX and uh, SRM. What excites me for UNH is definitely the NSX and vCloud Air. So we're looking to leverage a hybrid cloud type setup, especially with some of our apps that require a little more high availability than our next app. We're doing stuff today that I two years ago didn't think would even be possible.